Hey everybody, Mr. Lawrence here. This is the Piano Adventure Series by Nancy and Randall Faber. Level 2A Lesson Book, page 36. The name of the two songs on this is This Right Hand Old Man and This Left Hand Old Man. <laughs> okay, so this is playing with the D five finger scale. You play the chord in the left hand, then you play some notes, the A, the F sharp, and the A in the right hand. Here again, you have the chord in the left hand while the notes are playing with the right hand, or the right hand are playing the notes. Look here. Left hand crosses over to play that B with your second finger. Kind of weird, okay? It's just a little different. I shouldn't say weird, it's just different. So, so your left hand is gonna come up from playing these chords all the way up to playing that B as your right hand continues with those notes, okay? Notice your rhythm here. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, and four. One, and two, and three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. With a repeat, okay? This is this right hand old man. Here it goes. Okay, now I want you to notice that your right hand and left hand move the same direction here. Bum, 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 bum. D, E, F sharp, G, A. But then right here at the end, it looks like they play the same thing, but your right hand is playing F sharp, E, and D, while your left hand is playing the A, the G, the F sharp. Make sure you read your notes. Okay? Don't ever just assume what's going on. Make sure that your note reading is accurate. Make sure that you're playing with the correct fingers. Okay, correct fingering. Now this left hand old man, the melody that was played in the right hand here is now changed and it, the left hand gets to play it while the right hand plays full chords. Okay, you see that? All right, not hard to see, just making sure you do. All right, the left hand plays this B. So I'll, I'm gonna show you what this looks like, then I'm gonna play this, okay? So we have A, F sharp, A, A, F sharp, A, and then the second finger crosses over to play that right there, okay? Not hard, it's gonna look like this. That's A, F sharp, A, and then cross over. You see that? There's nothing hard about this. You don't have to move your hand way over on all over and you just leave your thumb in place boom 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 and then cross over that second finger you can just sit there and practice that it's just a matter of stretching the little muscles inside your fingers to do that okay it's not complicated so here is this left hand old man Okay, I will say this, one little tricky spot that oftentimes students uh, will miss is this little easy rhythm right here. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. We see all these notes in here and we don't pay attention to how many are there really. So sometimes I have students not play all four of those. Sometimes I have students play five of those. Okay, so it's just one, two, three, and four. Same thing occurs up here in the right hand. One, I'm sorry, one, two, three, and four. 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 Or one, two, three, and four. 
Okay? So pay attention to those things. I'm going to sign off for now. Bye.